What's good? What's good? What's good? We hit him. Hit him in a little bit of pain. Put in a little pain. Uh, start with the warm up. We're gonna do push ups, pull ups, dips. Uh -huh. and then we're gonna get into that chest workout. All right. All right. All right. Let's eat. Let's get it. Dips just to get my, my push muscles going and get my shoulders warmed up. Aesthetics, the only thing, only way to make it lighter is you get lighter. Right. And you, you develop strength of your own body. So why can certain people bench like 315 but can't do a pull-up? Because one, those two are different exercises. Okay. You will say if they they could bench 315, they right. should be able to do push-ups, because that's the same exercise. They should oh, push. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, or they should be able to do a certain amount of dips. Right. Because that's triceps, his chest. Right. You should be able to hit that. Right. For not being able to do a pull up will be more lat pull downs. Okay. Like if you could if you could do the whole rack right. of lat pull downs, you should be able to get up there. Right. If you are under that weight of the whole rack. Like some of those dudes that's doing 300 are 300. Right. You know what I mean? So that's why it's not like even though it's heavy weight, they still heavier than that. Right.
over here pussy footing around. Get to a weight, do three, four sets of that, and then maybe your last set, you uh, superset it like that for maximum burnout. Uh -huh. And then we get to the other stuff where it's high value, high reps. Use that first compound lift as something that rips and tears them, I mean, as much muscle tissues as you can. Because right. you already do calisthenics, you come in here right. to, to, to do some trauma, right. trying to rip these muscles apart Thanks. so they can rebuild Thanks. more jack than swole. That's right. Up. These peck flies, <clears throat> what we gotta do is, instead of going for reps, we set it to a moderate weight, moderate weight, and we go for as many reps within a minute. So we're going for time and reps. We're not just going for 20 a set, 15 a set. What we do is to get as many reps as, as possible so we can stimulate this muscle and keep the tension going for as many as possible. That doesn't mean short yourself. That means keep going. But see how many you can do, and over time, increase the weight if you need to, if you get to too many reps in a set. Thanks. My body has not seen this kind of chest fatigue then hit 225. Um, this, this joint feel heavy. This don't feel like 225 at all. My joint, the muscle fatigue really is crazy right now. Let's get money though. Stuck. Heard up, stuck turned to Shiki, and Shiki just put me through a crazy good workout. It was good, out of my comfort zone of how I format things. Like, I don't do 225 at the end. Right. I, I do, right, my benching right. is normally at the beginning, right. the compound, and then I get into the high volume stuff. Mm -hmm. So that made this 225 feel crazy. The other dumbbell stuff, 20 reps, 18 reps, then we got down to like fives. More, uh, more of my comfort zone. Now, I don't have a comfort zone when it comes down to this. It's just more of the format was different. Right. And starting off with the calisthenic setup, which I haven't done in a minute anyway. Yeah. So, good money. Thank you.